no. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. Eat shit and die. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Oh, I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. No. Oh, as if you care. that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He you burned my diary. I'm always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird going on with you. Whoa. <laughs> Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh. It's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please. Don't do this. This final dose won't hurt. What? David! No, David! No! Jesus! David Madsen! He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody at Blackwell did, right, Max? Okay, let's try this one last time. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh. You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Uh, excuse me, but my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable.
promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? No gun. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. David Madsen. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. Holden, it's over. Max, are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. No, thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. No signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. But you won't need this anymore. Max, I'm sorry you had to be here. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. at me like that. Damn. Now, Jefferson torched everything. The hell is this now the only photo I can get is the one Warren took. Oh. That's Victoria's bracelet. I bet Jefferson was going to use that to frame Nathan. I had no idea he was this sick. You won't need those glasses again. I can still feel those straps. Stop, Max. You're free. The Prescott's had to know about this. Jefferson looks so... pathetic now. No more fucking guns. Every song you hear in jail will be torture. You'll never be free again. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. Oh, Chloe, I'm gonna save you for the last time. There's no way I'm leaving your necklace here. Looks like Jefferson was planning a major security renovation with Prescott cash. I had no idea. No one would have looked for Nathan's body with this. Dear, he was this sick. You won't be going, Jefferson, to any more shows. Jefferson had plenty of women who would have totally posed for him. But he didn't want to give his subjects a choice. Max, I'm sorry you had to be here. David Madsen is on the case. He's still looking for evidence. 
David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was... was gonna kill me. Like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. You kind of suspected everybody. Yes, and this is what I get for wasting all those hours on the Prescotts. I set my sights too wide. Lack of focus. I know the feeling. I guess I looked just as suspicious when you told Principal Wells that I was harassing Kate Marsh. And I don't blame you. And Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. Don't blame yourself. Nathan and Jefferson are the ones who put her up there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No, I, I should have told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and, and almost used it. I put the school in danger. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. We... We are a great team. That's one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Even in the service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not gonna make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but... I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too. But... You saw how that went. You tried. It's obvious you care. Even if your methods are... Fucked up. I know. I'm glad I stood up for you. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she... She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. And I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but... Maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. So, where is Chloe? David, um, she was pretty stressed out, so, um, she went to go, um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air and use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Go on now. You've seen enough of this room. Okay, teacher. Let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. Jefferson will end up in jail. But Chloe is dead. You're fucked, Jefferson. Not for long. Computer. I could have told David the truth. He deserves it. God damn you. Freedom. Holy shit. This storm is real. I need to find one.
Yes! Warren, can you hear me? Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thanks to this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm is getting smaller. I'm kind of scared. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. striking us down. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, goddammit, how do I pay all those taxes? You have one new message. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say... I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 